Okay. See, like, in the back yeah, middle. Yeah, make sure you watch Cap. Yeah. There's KU laying down. I just shouldn't He's be right under that one, doing what I did. Yeah, KU was watching. The, yeah, you found him. He's like in the middle of the two windows, laying down on the ground. He ran right to the left side now. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Are you in here? Do you want to die? Yes. You know, run out on me. QE, QE, QE. Kate's downstairs running by steps. What the? Why is he there? I don't know, Kat too funny. How did I not kill him? Flash and pull down, maybe. Nice. Good job. Dude, you're yeah, actually you're fucking insane. Good shit. You almost got me killed, thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. You motherfucker. <laughs> hey, man. It wasn't the worst play call. It wasn't, but it almost got me killed. I mean, you probably should have flashed the doorway and the hallway. Well, I heard him on that staircase, I just didn't expect Please, him to run all the way around. Oh, did this guy actually just do what I think he did? I don't know, I got a Valken though. Oh my god. Alright, well, it looks like I'm not going through there. What is happening over there? I don't know, man, I'm terrified. Is everyone dying? Sorry, God, if this is open but not open on my screen, I'm gonna cry. Okay. Let me know what you see, and I'm gonna flash into sight. Push it. We need help. There's one fountain. You probably need help. Yep. Oh, I couldn't fucking turn fast enough. So here's the thing. I can Candela completely into sight. I don't know where Just run right in. Let me use my phones. She sounds like she's on me. Use your phone. It's uh, barricaded off on the left to hallway. Yeah, kitchen. Kitchen. Yeah. There's one in laundry room closet. Or storage, whatever. He's Maverick, do you have there. any more blowtorches to break the hatch, or...? She's in the room where Ping's at. Okay. Well, do I, I go that. for it? You said there was one in the closet, right? Yeah. Got no idea what she Oh, he was right next to me. Nice. Oh, Cap's gonna target. Oh, no. Cap, get the pump save. Dude. Just like that. Easy clap. You and me, man. That was actually some decent communications. Wait, what? What do you mean? I always give you decent communications. Yeah, like, that was, that was once in a lifetime of communications right there. I'm shocked that you didn't get, like, flashed to shit as well. I, I waited to go off. You, you timed it perfectly to run in. I, like, I, like, actually tried. I'm proud of you. You should drink more often before you play. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> drinking enhances decision making confirmed. That's you up there. Yeah, I just had the same reaction with you down there. <laughs> Oh, they're downstairs, aren't they? Oh, yeah, bud. What's my rook doing? 
dying. Okay, I have a plan. Wait, do you have breaching charges? Mm-hmm. This might be a little risky. If you wanna Suppressing fire. Watch it. Our teammate's already on site, so... I'm so sorry. Start flashing everyone. <laughs> Wait, did you get that kill? <laughs> <laughs> you just see Fuse walking up behind him. <laughs> do 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 do. You trying to rush? Uh, I I could be convinced to rush. All right, consider yourself convinced. Okay. Do I bring shotgun or LMG? Shotgun, yeah. it is. Up to you, pal. LMG is so good. I'll bring LMG. Bring cap can trap in construction. They have a mute. We're about to get fucked, aren't we? Okay, they put two, down two cap can traps and they barricaded it. Oh god, really? And then they put another cap can trap at the end and barricaded that door as well. So we should just not go down there, probably? Probably not. I'm gonna go through main door. <laughs> what? what is this guy? Gosh, what? Okay. <laughs> what was he doing? What an idiot! I don't know, I just realized we're sighted, so. Top of the construction stairs. Okay. So go downstairs. Um, Someone's lit. Take like down, down. Like fuse around here. Should be it though. I'm droning in. What? Why did it go hmm? off? Oh, no, no, no. oh, watch out! Don't go in the small. Here, good what? Shit, guys. Good shit, guys. Good shit. Why did you? <laughs> I was in there. <laughs> you fucker. <laughs> Before you went in. <laughs> I got bandit. They have no one in office right now. Just in so like, don't waste too much time sniping in from there. Oh, one's these stairs, that's for damn sure. <laughs> he just. Yeah, I got him. What a fucking dumbass. He didn't even notice I was shooting the door next to him. Someone's in that other building across. I think that's what he meant. Oh, well, four. Alright, right, Drew, is this worth doing? Probably not, but honest. probably. I hate my life. This fucking thing is so inconsistent. Oh boy. Well, they can't kill me, and I can't kill them, so. That's fun, I guess. Watch out for a mute coming behind. There's still one just sitting on this mirror. Bit of trouble. I think our dog is lagging out as well. Oh fuck! Small tower. 
Uh-uh. Oof. Yeah. I'll be back. His internet just fucked up. You got this, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Slightly stuck. Probably shouldn't have opened that. That's fine. I don't actually know what that looks like. Oh yeah, I do know. Yeah, I might be able to just flash outside and run in. Yeah, we're gonna need to start doing that quick, cause are we done? Is there one behind that back wall? I don't know, there's one firing back at me. I think there might be more fountain area. Yeah, they are. Oh, I love this right really <sighs> Ah, that curse is low. Yep, you got him. Oh, that's gonna break. Oh, that's also gonna break. Oh. It's okay, you just curse modded herself. <laughs> that person was lying down next to her. I fucked up. I should have had that dock easily. And he's the. That was his first kill this entire match. Cause I fucked up. So how was your dad's birthday party? <laughs> the Christmas party was great. Why did they go kitchen? What are these guys doing? I had to like, I had a couple of drinks. Ooh. <laughs> and the way I told it to Bree was like, I had to talk to a bunch of, or like 30 adults who hadn't seen me since I was in quotes this big. What's this big? Is that just what all of said? Yeah, you know, it's like, oh, I haven't seen you since you were this big. Uh, how many drinks did you have? Like, four. That explains a lot. What? My decision making's been okay. What the fuck are these strats that they're running? I'm so yeah, confused. Pretty sure they've had the drinks. They're in the kitchen, yeah? Bar teams. Throw him. Yep. One west me. Trophy, yeah. Hmm. I'm probably That's... gonna. Upstairs by library. It's bandit. One in trophy still. <laughs> and that's why I love Ying. Hey everyone, that concludes the tip and highlight portion of this Operator Mastery video. Now before we wrap up the whole video, let's go over Ying's loadout and what I recommend. Ying has two primary weapons, the T95 LSW light machine gun and then the 612 shotgun. Out of the two guns, as many of you can probably imagine, I highly recommend the T95. Every single highlight in this video did show off that gun, mainly because it's much more consistent than the shotgun. I have gotten a lot of good results with the shotgun, but they're mainly on stream and usually in lower elo lobbies, when you can flash out sight and then just shotgun everyone. But I'd say those are much fewer and farther between than the T95 highlight reels. So let's talk light machine gun. Here are the attachments that I normally use. For sight I have an ACOG, for barrel I have a compensator, and then for grip I have a vertical grip. And I don't use the underbarrel laser. The only thing I can recommend is changing the sight depending on your situation. And then if you do change the sight, then maybe change the barrel attachment as well. So I use the ACOG because I prefer to just have an ACOG in case if I ever have to engage in long range combat. I personally have a hard time seeing anyone from a far distance with any of the one time sights, so ACOG is always good for me. However, it does increase the amount of time it takes to aim down sight and can make it a little bit harder to use in close quarters combat. 
So if you're planning on candeling into site and then running right in, maybe a one-time scope would be better for that. But as you can see from all the highlights I showed you, you generally have enough time to aim down site, and you're not really putting yourself at a risk by choosing an ACOG. But if you do choose ACOG, I recommend the compensator for the attachment, for the barrel, just because you're going to be firing a lot, and I personally prefer to just control vertical recoil instead of both horizontal and vertical, and compensator helps with that. But if you're going one-time sight, then for the barrel attachment, I highly recommend the flash hider, just because it's much easier to control recoil with a one-time sight than an ACOG. Now, if you do choose to go for the 612 shotgun for attachments, sight is kind of optional. You really don't need one, since most of the time you'll just be hip-firing but I do recommend having a laser on it just because you're going to be running in. Laser, I'd say, only take off if you're going for destruction, but you're not going to be going for destruction on attack with a shotgun. You're going to be wanting to kill people. But yeah, overall, I'd just recommend the underbarrel laser, and the sight is optional. For secondaries, Ying only has the one pistol, Q929, and it's a pretty powerful pistol. It has a 60 damage shot, which is fairly high for almost any handgun. And as far as attachments go, you don't need the underbarrel laser on any of the pistols, and muzzle brake is just always better than silencer, so I highly recommend the muzzle brake. Now for secondary gadget, there's kind of some debate here. I always use the claymore just because I think I'd rather have something watching my back, as opposed to being able to breach into sight, but I do see a lot of people bringing in breach charges. One of the common strats I've seen with Ying is to hop breach from one window while having a candela go off on another. While it does tend to work, Usually in the lower ranks, I've found that as you go up in the higher ranks, people are always going to hear when you're placing them a breach charge, so for the most part, it really doesn't help too much. The only time I'd ever bring a breach charge over the claymore is if you're going for vertical destruction, but if you're part of any competent team, generally you'll have a sledge or a buck to do that for you, and you don't really need to bring it. So my personal preference is to always bring the claymore. Even though I'm fairly certain I never once used my secondary gadget in this entire video. But that is it for Ying's loadout. Just to quickly recap, my overall recommended loadout for Ying is running the T95 LMG with an ACOG compensator and vertical grip, and the only secondary you can have, which is the pistol, and running the muzzle brake on it, and then for secondary gadget, running a claymore. Feel free to experiment with it however you want, but I have found that this loadout, for me at least, has been the most consistent. It almost always works. And that'll be it for the Ying Operator Mastery video. If you guys have any questions or comments, let me know in the comment section down below. Or if you want to watch me play Ying even more, you can go check out my Twitch channel. I will likely be playing Ying for most of today, just because the Operator Mastery video came out. And you guys can also ask me questions or make comments on the video live on Twitch as well. So go check it out. Link is on the screen and in the description below. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.